Hello, everybody, wherever you may be. My name's Larry. My call sign's Kilo 7 Hotel November. I'd like to welcome you all from around the world. This is Ham Radio Live. Today, got a special short program showing you about a very unique product. Please subscribe. We don't do any ads here. There is zero monetization on this channel, no monetization at all. Just subscribe. That's all we ask. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to the show here. Quick show just to show the MFJ 1708 SDR switch. This is an amazing switch, something I think that every ham shack should have. I'll explain how it works, okay? The MFJ 1708 is specially designed to protect an SDR play or similar product from RF going into it and making it go kaboom, okay? So that doesn't work anymore. This switch helps to literally ground the SDR portion so that it doesn't pick up any RF when you hit the mic on this, okay? Now, there is a 100-watt transmit limit. Can't go over 100 watts. But the beautiful part of this is it allows you to transmit on one frequency, say, for example, on an ICOM 7300, and you'll be able to use this and be able to use the pan adapter screen, which allows you to work dual receivers at the same time transmitting on one while not destroying this little box right there or something similar to that. Let me show you how it works briefly so you all understand. Here's the 7300 that I have. Let me turn it up. There's a signal here. At least there was. Looks to still be there. I don't want to go up here because that's a net. So we'll just hopefully there he is. I'm a I'm a one ninety five county. I've been parking my butt here, but I, I figure it's kinda of like camping, you know, uh, when you get on the frequency. Now whatever, watch the S D R play so, when I transmit. And you'll see the big frequency spike come up, the RF spike. Kilo seven hotel November. See it? The 1708 just protected the SDR play from being hit with RF. Now let's see if this guy comes back. Again, you'll notice when you take a look, you'll see a red light come on when you hit transmit. Come on right over there, okay? But this little device, this SDR in a box, is not hurt. Kilo 7 Hotel November for a quick one. Okay, good one. Seeing the signal still here. 5 over F9. So, yeah, I've got all these uh, filters and amplifiers and everything else running on this radio trying to pull the signals out of the mud. So, you're right up there now. Kilo 7 Hotel November, Oregon. And if he doesn't come back, we'll try another frequency, okay? Don't make it easy. But the 1708 makes it so you don't burn up the SDR play. You're not going to ruin that digital SDR box with a shot of RF. Once RF hits it, because it's a receiver, a very sensitive one at that, it destroys it. That's why the 1708 is so important. It automatically senses once you hit the PTT to hit the relay and ground the radio. Kilo 7 Hotel November. Kilo 7 Hotel November. How's everything up in Oregon? 
Doing well, thank you. Doing a quick YouTube video here on a product from MFJ. Contra Frequency wanted to say hello. What's your call sign? Roger, you're a 5'5 five five here into Independence, Oregon. want to thank you so much for picking up the call. I'll give you a final. I'll wait for yours. I thank you for being part of the show. I'll send a copy to your QRZ page. Kilo 6, Foxtrot, Echo Juliet, Kilo 7, Hotel November. Thank you so much for the quick, quick QSO. Roger, Roger, no problem. Well, I, 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 I will look forward to getting a copy and uh, call it my claim to fame over. <laughs> All right, so that's how it works. Essentially, you get the chance to use a web SDR on one end. That's the web SDR that's run by SDR Play. So when you're using this, you're essentially taking a look at it on the laptop. You see all the signals there. You can tune to whatever you want, whether it be on the same frequency band or a different one. You could be searching for different signals, but not give up the call you have because the MFJ 1708 will protect that SDR play. It is an essential part of your ham shack to make sure you can now go dual receive single operator, maybe, right? Single operator dual receive in a contest or possibly just to chase some fantastic DX. Thanks to the people at MFJ for making a great product. That's the MFJ 1708 SDR. It is the SDRS in this iteration because it comes with an SMA connection. Without it, it would be an SO239. Thank you for watching, everybody. Ham Radio Live is not monetized by any way, shape, or form. There's no ads here. We just ask that you subscribe. Thanks for watching, everybody. Until next time, my name's Larry. My call signs Kilo 7 Hotel November. Goodbye, everybody.